In today's class, we are going to discuss about differentiation between monohybrid cross and dihybrid cross. So, first time we will monohybrid cross. Kona. The cross in which a single character is taken into consideration at a time is known as monohybrid cross. Jitte bade, I am a gote hi character ko gote particular time re jodi I am a consider karu chanti tahele seta amar asiba monohybrid cross re. Jem the ethi pila khala the cross in which two characters are taken into consideration at a time is known as dihybrid cross. Mane ekka sangre I am simultaneously di ta character ko study kore taku ko haba dihybrid cross. Ebon gote character Study कोले हमें ताकु कहीं बस single character जो दिया study कर चुन्दे इसे हैला monohybrid cross यार example हैला हमारा stem height यार example हैला हमारा seed shape and seed color the phenotypic ratio of monohybrid cross is three to one the phenotypic ratio of dihybrid cross is nine to three to three to one the genotypic ratio of monohybrid cross is one to two to one the genotypic ratio of dihybrid cross is one to two to one to two to four to two to one to two to one Two different types of gametes are produced by the F1 plant that is capital T and small t means it has a tall plant or allele it has a recessive plant or allele. Four different types of gametes are produced by the F1 plant. Simply ki capital R capital Y or chhi. Mane eti seed ra shape hai bo round or color hai bo yellow. It, next la capital R small Y. Mane seed ra shape hai bo round seed ra color hai bo green. Small r capital Y. I mean, seed is safe, is wrinkled, color is yellow. Small r small Y. I mean, it derives two law from monohybrid cross and Mendel derives only one law from the dihybrid cross. These two law are law of dominance and law of segregation. This law is also called as law of purity of gametes and another law that is law of independent assortment which is derived from the dihybrid cross.